We're looking for Tony the Tiger today. Welcome to the Joy of Trucking. It's not there and there's actually a sign on the door telling people to come over here to Tony the Tiger. And this is Kellogg's. <laughs> I used to love Tony the Tiger. I had a Tony the Tiger uh, beach towel and I left it on the subway in Frankfurt when I was a kid. I was crushed. We even called the public transit to see if they had it. <coughs> Excuse me, and they're lost and found. <coughs> but they did not. To this day, I'm still sad about it. Because he was great! <laughs> All right, hey, Kevin. As you can hear, my voice is still very bad from my cold. Yeah. I'm wondering if you could tell our viewers what's going on here. We are picking up our load at Kellogg's in Omaha, Nebraska, and we're going to take it down to LA. It's really, really cold outside. They gave us the address on the uh, tablet there and pulled into the place, walked up to the door, and it said, this is not Kellogg's, although their address looks to be the same as ours go across the street so we had to pull back out down the street come in here to the guard shack and now we're here to pick up our load so let's get our load and get out yeah. town and where are we going with that load i think that's pretty exciting la i said la did you say I LA? said los angeles oh yeah. you said los yeah. angeles yeah. Real, so because it it's, Real it's Real like oh. it's with the wind chill it's about minus 18 here today i think we'll head south as soon as possible we might, we might get to Denver tonight. It's still going to be cold there, but uh, tomorrow is looking much better. Route planning, the first thing I did was look at the weather because uh, right now there's a storm, a uh, winter storm coming through. Uh, there's ice, there's huge wind chill, there's some places have rain, some places have a lot of snow. And the, the, the most direct route, shortest miles, took us through Denver and over I-70, over the Rocky Mountains. I'm not doing that. I checked the weather right away. It's going to snow there. And I'm not doing that. So the next route would be across I-80 all the way to Salt Lake City. And then from there down to Las Vegas. But tonight it's going to be below zero in uh, Wyoming. And I don't want to spend the night there. So we're going to go to Denver and then head down to Albuquerque. Well, go, go and you have that steep mountain passage down in the Salt Lake. Yeah, Salt Lake has a steep mountain passage as well. Okay, yeah. I gotta go. Yeah, you gotta go. He's gotta go. Bye. Uh, okay, bye. You can't uh, put on your vest. That's yeah, I gotta put on my vest. I gotta clean up the trailer and dump it into that dumpster. I'm gonna put the empty up here and then go over there to pick up my load and come back and see him for the bill of lading and we're out of here do you know what you're actually what are we bringing Corn i haven't seen the bill of lading i don't know i haven't seen the bill of lading i wonder if it is frosted flakes maybe we're bringing the mascot the tiger himself do you have your tiger endorsement On the Warner trucks, you have a kingpin release switch on the dashboard. So from the comfort of your cab, after you have released the glad hands and the pigtail and cranked down the landing gear, you get in the truck, you flip a switch, the kingpin releases and you drive away. Well, I tried that release three times and it didn't move. Now considering the temperature is minus 16 with the wind chill, Thought maybe it's frozen. Luckily, Werner gives you uh, an extension handle so you can reach in there and manually release the kingpin, which is what 
That's it. Successfully. There's our trailer. 369 522. Did you have to shoot full the ice? No. But I did wear gloves. manually pulling it. It's not like it was, you know, encased in ice and crud and stuff like that. It's just probably the airline to the, it's a pneumatic system. So there's an airline to an air cylinder that forces the, the release to move. So maybe there's some moisture in there. The air cylinder was too cold or had a little ice in it. No big deal. This is a minor thing. Thanks for joining us today as Kevin put into use his Tiger endorsement. If you liked the video, please do give it a thumbs up. You can put your comments and questions below. Hit that subscribe button and the notification bell and be sure to join us in the next video where we're going to have a beautiful ride from Omaha, Nebraska to almost Denver, Colorado. Have a great day with love from Kevin and Tanya. Bye.